I'm Don Harper, Olympic hurdler, and I want to show you two drills that I believe, yes, they can be very simple, but are very effective. It's a hurdle drill that you're going to do on the wall. You're going to use one hurdle, and for me, a professional hurdler, 33 is my height. You may still be beginning, so 30 may be the height that you need to use. So once again, I'm using a 33-inch hurdle height, and I'm going to step about five steps back, five feet, heel to toe, back from the hurdle. I'm gonna put my lead leg in front because what I wanna do is I wanna step into this hurdle and pitch into the wall, okay? You see, I'm going above the hurdle. This is perfect to help you aim for the hurdle height, but you can slow it down. So you step into it right on top. Notice the arms, the arm is pitched forward, the trail arm is punched back. Step back, pitch into it. Now notice also, that this step into it is now going to get aggressive because this is just as if you're stepping into the hurdle and you're actually going to run over the top in a hurdle race, okay? That's how it should go, okay? And also notice that I'm stretched out over the top of the hurdle. Sometimes you see people, they get nervous in, with this drill and they don't want to go that hard at the wall, so they're crunched. And you notice my hips are dipped? You want to be tall and open, okay? Tall and open. You don't want to be close where you like this, that's wrong. You want to step back, be aggressive, step into it. Step into it, above that hurdle. Step into it. Now the next hurdle drill that I want to do is going to work on the trail leg. You're going to move it back about three and a half steps, heel to toe. Now you're going to bring your lead leg in front of the hurdle because when you hurdle, everything is about muscle memory. You don't want to step on the side or behind because when you're actually hurdling in a race, your lead leg comes over the top, okay? And you're gonna lean forward, first movement, bring that trail toe up, around, back to the front, and down, okay? To the side, around, and down. If you wanna work on something and you really, really, really wanna feel this trail leg, Go all the way to the front and down, bring it up, put that foot on the wall. You should be able to grab that wall and come down. To the side, around, down. To the side, up, around, and down. Make sure those hips are staying tall. Some people get here and it's hard to bring it up. You have to come up, hips are up. Hips have to be up, it's very important. This is strengthening your hip flexor, and this is practicing for muscle memory, those hip flexors. The first one was about that lead leg, you broke it up. You worked on that lead leg, you got it strong and effective, perfect over the top every time, working on those arms. This next one was about that trail leg, around and down, around and down, around and down, and that's what it's about. So then when you put it together over the top of the hurdle, muscle memory, don't have to think about it as much, and you can go straight into it. 